In this video, we're going to talk about troubleshooting the diaphragm in the series 2200 high pressure control valve. There are two common issues that indicate diaphragm problems. You might detect air or gas blowing out of the vent hole, or the valve may not be stroking properly and you're not sure why. If the valve isn't operating and you suspect you have a diaphragm issue, first, you'll check to see if the valve is stroking. Do this by introducing air to the instrument air side, and you should see the valve move or open. If the valve doesn't open, check the vent to see if gas is escaping by putting your finger over the vent hole. If the diaphragm is leaking, you'll need to replace it. For best possible performance and operation, you should always use genuine NoraSeal replacement parts. First, take a few safety precautions. Isolate the valve from the system. Then shut off all supply lines to the actuator and release the process pressure for both upstream and downstream. Finally, vent and disconnect the actuator supply pressure. Mark the location of the lock nut on the adjusting screw so that you can return to that location upon reassembly. Loosen the lock nut on the adjusting screw on top of the actuator spring housing. Turn the adjusting screw counterclockwise until the spring's preload is completely removed. Then, remove the nuts and screws from around the diaphragm housing flange and remove the upper diaphragm housing, spring, and upper retainer. Be careful to avoid damaging any part of the diaphragm housing. Replace the diaphragm and then reassemble it in reverse order. Make sure you reset the tension on the springs and recheck for leaks. Use the star pattern bolting process when retightening and tighten the bolts enough to create a seal and prevent leaks. Finally, check for leaks by actuating the valve from your Nora Seal control device. For more information on troubleshooting your valves, download our new series 2200 Operations and Maintenance Manual at www.noraseal.com.